What's up guys? Welcome back to Good Enough Food Reviews. We're going to keep the intro short this time. That's right. Because we're getting some grief about that. <laughs> so you already know the deal. You know how we do. You know how we get down. You know what we're doing here. If you don't, or if it's your first time watching, watch the other two. All right? That'd be a good idea. Absolutely. Guess You'll be lost without them. You'll be lost. Yeah. You'll be lost without it. So today, we've got Dairy Queen. We've got McDonald's. And we've got Chick-fil-A. That's right. Let's break down these prices, okay. here, dog. We got five forty-five for the Dairy Queen, five thirty-four for the McDonald's, McD's, McD's, and four ninety-one for the Chick-fil-A. Now I have to come right out and say I have a very strong bias on this one. I you do love Chick-fil-A with all of my heart. The he Lord's does. Chicken he is does. solid in my life, and I would eat this every day if I could. I have a very negative opinion of both of these to start out. So I'm hoping to be surprised, but full disclosure, total bias in this review. I'm expecting Dairy Queen's gonna be terrible. It may be worse than Sonic, but I don't think it's gonna be. We ranked be. it pretty low when, right. when we did these groupings. We, yeah. we didn't have very high expectations. But everyone says the McDonald's is extremely good. Let me catch you off guard. So we'll see what happens. Yeah. All right. Intro. This was shorter. That's right. So what do you have to say now? Let's get after it. All right. Number one, Chick-fil-A, which we're assuming is going to be the best. I'm hoping. Safe assumption? Safe assumption. The good thing about Chick-fil-A, I'll say, is it's the same every time. Always consistent. Miles may vary on some others. That's right. But Chick-fil-A... It's always good. And my favorite part about Chick-fil-A is I can eat it and I don't feel bad. Okay. Chick-fil-A has never made me feel bad. These other ones... My, fa my favorite part is how it tastes. <laughs> well, that's what this is strictly based it's on. also the Lord's the Chicken. Taste. That's so, right. So it's If blessed. you don't like it, get wrecked. <laughs> it's okay. too blessed to be stressed. So sure. here we go. Let's give it a little close-up action. So we added mayo right. because we didn't want to put... Chick-fil-A's amazing sauce on it, that would just make it the best. That wouldn't be fair. Not fair. So we got what? Soft bun, always. Butter. Tender. Mm. Very tender. Not the thickest chicken, to be fair. But Pickle, always. Let's be fair. Yeah. But always Pickle. about a consistent size. Always yeah. the same. Just always the same. Now, I have only had this one once. I've had the spicy chicken sandwich about a gazillion oh, times. And it's straight banger. Straight banger. Let's this is my go-to order. Go. I get this sandwich on a regular basis. I want to make sure that I have pickle in the bite. All right, here Let's we get go. after it. It's so good. Mm -hmm. No, it's just like the spice is just not spicy. Mm -hmm. I wasn't sure if it'd be a little different. Now, I'm going to say this. Chick-fil-A, mm. I don't like your pickles. I like pickles in most chicken sandwiches. We've talked about this. Yep. We've had a disagreement here. I usually take the pickles off because they're soggy and soft. I don't like pickles in general. On a chicken sandwich, I like pickles. Did yep. you say that's fair? That's about an me? accurate that assessment accurate? of how you feel about pickles. Okay. Absolutely. Okay. What, do you, what are your thoughts? I love it. And I like the pickles. They are soggy. I wonder what it would be like with better pickles. Because I can see how they're not the best What pickles. if it had Jack's pickles? Then it might be like unbeatable at that point. Yeah, if I had one, one nitpick bite. about the Chick-fil-A sandwich, it would be the pickles. But That's I usually it. actually do extra pickles, spread them out, get an extra bite mm -hmm. or an extra pickle in each bite. So, but I can see how you would think that the pickles were not mm -hmm. quite as good. So I think it's, I think it's great. It's great. Chick-fil-A can tend to be a little greasy for me, but it's the Lord's grease. So it doesn't even count, like the calories don't count, none of that, because it's all so blessed. I'm going to give this 8.2. It's far above average. Absolutely. It's not my all-time favorite. I knew it wouldn't be, but it's a very safe, always good. I will never not like it. That's I will right. never not want it. I am going to, I'm, I'm taking in my 
bias in this. Yeah, and I'm going to give it... It's good. Radiating 27 off of million. One million. <laughs> no, I'm going to give it... Uh, I'm going to go 8-4. Eight, 8-4. Four. Eight, four. Because I, I do love it. I love the buttery bun. I think, I think you're it's being the buttery fair. bun. You're being eight, very fair. fair with your bias. Yes. Yeah. Because I would give it a 10, you know, just from... I know if I'm judging from the heart, it's a 10 every time. But I'm going to give it an 8-4. This is hard for you because everything to you is... is it's the, the best. best. Everything's the best. The best. There's no middle this ground. Is the best chicken so we're, we're growing ever had. <laughs> we're growing here. All right, what do you want to do next? I say we go DQ next. All right, DQ next. Hold on a second. Okay. Dairy Queen. Dairy Are you ready? I'm ready. Now, I think I'm ready. I, I have only had Dairy Queen one other time in my life, and that's when I was doing a Sonic vs. DQ chili dog. Which you haven't watched that. Go check Straight it out. Banger. For Straight some banger. reason, very low quality. Yeah. It's got. 7,000 views on it. <laughs> People like that, okay? Apparently. That's the only time I've ever had food. Now, the Blizzard, All day, story. every day. Different story. They're fantastic. But what we have to bring up is when we started this, I Googled, and they had a crispy chicken sandwich on their menu. We get there, they don't. Yeah, apparently they have a chicken, a chicken tender sandwich, chicken strip, strip. strip sandwich. Okay. So it's two strips on a bun, which okay. makes splitting it in half easy. So it's just but, a regular bun. Yep. It smells like a cafeteria, and it's literally a chicken strip. And so let's we got some close up action. We added. Do we add? No, nope, this one had mayo had already mayo. on it. Yeah. And it had a tomato. No but, pickle. But we don't want a tomato on it. <sighs> yeah. Why okay. would? Why they put tomato and no pickle at these places? I don't understand we, at all what they're Now, doing. we did, for your birthday yesterday, yesterday was Jeremy's birthday, right. so happy belated. Thank you very much. We had some chicken tenders last minute yep. that were frozen, and they were really good. They were good. And they looked better than this. Absolutely. That's, I'm just, I'm not. They, you're not wrong. I'm not trying to be a hater. And they added the, the Dollar General lettuce is back. Yep. So. Dollar oh, General lettuce <laughs> making a comeback. Yeah. So let's give it a try. Oh boy. No pickles on this one. I know. What are they? I don't understand why they don't do that. Does your tender taste old? Mm-hmm. Mine tastes old. Not good. It's getting worse. It's, it's getting, it. yeah, it's not good. Not good at all. Uh, about what I expected, if I'm being 100, as the kids like to say. Mm -hmm. um, I'm ready to, I'm going to rate it. You I'm ready. You I'm going to give it a 2-3. It's so bad. It's not good at all. I'm going to give it a 2.0. Yeah. It's I would never order that again. And I think that's very fair. Yeah, very fair. Uh, DQ. And that chicken's probably been there since they opened oh, this morning. So it definitely has. Not good. And in all fairness, we were trying to have an even number of restaurants. And yeah. we had one more, and I just was looking yeah, around. Dairy Queen fair. has one. Let's yeah. try it. <laughs> Let's try it. So, yeah. This now, the Blizzard bad. versus McFlurry versus Chick fil A milkshake review. That one. I also have, I a, might, they might I also have a Blizzard review. Uh, uh, and cookie no one's bunch. gonna no one's gonna beat that one, number one. Sonic, your blasts are terrible because you don't put enough candy in them. Yes. And then they're all at the bottom and if you ask for extra, they give you the amount they should have had and charge you more. <laughs> yes. And that's not cool. And McDonald's never works. So yes, you can't ever but get that when thing. it does, Pretty good. it's the perfect amount of mixture and you have the cool spoon. That's right. So that versus a blizzard might be a good that idea. That might be a good idea. We could idea. throw in Sonic to but make stick it fair. To, stick to ice cream. Stick to ice cream. Don't make chicken That's sandwiches. our fault for going to Dairy Queen. <laughs> That's right. Our fault. All right. So now we're moving on to McDonald's. Last but not least, McD's. McDonald's. McDonald's. As, McDonald's. as some people say, <laughs> McDonald's. Oh, boy. We've got, <laughs> you see right here, pretty thick, uh, Safe to say they're maybe modeling it after Chick-fil-A. Correct. It looks very much like it. The bun is different than a normal McDonald's bun. They don't have the sesame seeds. It's very seems greasy. Like it's though. got some butter on it. Yeah. Oh, greasy. That Which, sounds familiar. Yeah, We've got does. some pickle action. Yep. Now, I have tried the spicy one before recently. I usually don't eat at McDonald's, but I tried it recently and it gave me Chick-fil-A vibes and I did not have any sauce on it. So we added mayo to make it fair. To make it fair. So Jeremy has an extreme McDonald's bias. I, I have not had McDonald's 
I can't tell you the last time I ate McDonald's. Yeah. I'm and gonna... it's been a. Uh, I used to eat it a lot when I was a kid. Same. Uh, the movie Super Size Me ruined me. Same. For McDonald's, and Same. I said I'll never eat there again. Here yeah, we are. Uh, here we are. Yeah, here I never, am. Never, never a say, thing to say. Never say. So let's no. give it a go. Why don't we go? Let's do it. Hmm. I mean, it tastes pretty good. I don't want it to. <laughs> but why do I like you so much? But it does. Mm -hmm. Now, that's, that's, it's yeah. pretty good. And it's, I'm gonna tell you now. It's gonna be in the eights. I'm not gonna. T I'm not ready to say eight wow. point what, but it's in the eights. Sorry. I am very pleasantly surprised. Um. I did not expect it to be this good. I don't know what I'm gonna rate it. I think I need another bite to determine. Okay. That. The spicy one's better. And the reason I don't add sauce is I'm pretty sure there's a spicy sauce on it. Mm -hmm. I think that's what the mm -hmm. difference is. And this one here is a surprise. Very surprise. It's a sleeper. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. It's not a sleep, but it's a sleeper. <laughs> Write that down. Write that down. <laughs> so very good. I'm gonna give this. I never thought these would be coming on up. Eight point one. Wow. Th this is a good. It's a good sandwich. It's a good it's sandwich. Good. Um, what's What's interesting is, it's really good. It doesn't have like a really bold flavor. Like it's kind of like just solid. So I'm gonna come down a little. I'm gonna give it like a seven eight. Okay. Close, still really good. If I had to order this, I wouldn't be upset about it and I would eat the whole thing. But I don't think it's as good as like Jack's or Zaxby's or Bojangles, that level of, mm -hmm. of sandwich. Right. It's probably the best of the burger joints, if I had to guess. If I had to pick between this, Wendy's, all of the other ones, yeah. I think I would go here. Yeah, I can't believe I'm saying that. Yeah, but I would go to and, this overall. And I think one. the reason that I maybe give Chick Fil A up and up on just taste on its own is if I had the choice to go to both, I would feel better after eating Chick Fil A. Yeah, it would be more efficient. That's right. A little less sketchy. Better, way better customer service. I feel service. way better about myself. <laughs> That's accurate. And so they're close in taste, to be honest. I like the, I, again, I'm totally biased. I like whatever they do in the breading in the Chick-fil-A. It's, it, there's like, the bread is I, can't even, I can't even explain what it is, but I just, mm -hmm. I like the flavor. You're gonna have to explain it in detail. <laughs> well, that's well so, <laughs> all right, so let's wrap this thing up. That's right. And then we'll talk about the next video. Yeah. All right, guys. So the winner for today, what you got, Day Dog? Chick-fil-A, come Chick -fil on. Chick-fil-A's the winner, day. not by as much as, no, uh, as maybe we would have thought. Accurate. Accurate. To be fair, to be before funny. we started this whole thing, I thought it was gonna be like two, five, a million Chick Fil A wins yes. hands down. The fact that it was this close. When you said in the eights, I was like, oh no, because I'd rather in the next round eat Chick Fil A over McDonald's for sure. Yes. So I'm excited that Chick Fil A yes. is moving on. Uh, it's just always good. It is always, always good. good. Always good and always in your neighborhood, right? Yeah. As long as you live by a Target, it seems like. Accurate. Target, I like Starbucks, Target. Yeah. Chick-fil-A, all yeah. in the same vicinity. The white girl Mecca, <laughs> as they say. And no one says that. I just made it up on the spot. White girl Starbucks. White girl Starbucks. <laughs> Pumpkin spice lattes. Yes. It's fall, y'all, right? It is fall, y'all. So, in the next video, what we got? Popeyes. KFC and Hardee's. It's which, gonna be the best. For one. those of you West Coast folks, Hardee's is Carl's Jr. just on the East Coast. So, yes. uh, those three could be so the best of the group. It's sad they're paired together. I agree. Because someone's gotta win. Someone's gotta win. And also, someone has to lose. Yeah. So, so then we're going to take the winners. That's right. And they're gonna come up, they're gonna come up against each other. I'm excited about the next round. It's gonna the, be great. I don't. Th I think we're out of the woods when it comes to the really bad ones. Now I, have I to think stop we've gotten all the bad ones out. Wasting of money on yeah, exactly. junky sandwiches. Absolutely. So Sonic, DQ, Burger King, get wrecked. Get so out. that's it. Like, subscribe. Please leave Smash us a comment. Smash that notification bell because it helps. 
the, the algorithm. algorithm. Mm -hmm. Whatever that means, it helps it, and it needs help. That's right. So leave us a like 20 comments. All the comments. And we'll appreciate it. And we'll see you on the next That's one. Good.